My name is Kevin Smith. I'm the Deputy Project Team Manager in the Magnets team at Fusion for Energy. The PF coils provide a very important magnetic confinement for the super hot plasma in the Ita Tokamak. Six coils are required to provide this magnetic cage surrounding and containing the hot plasma. The European Union has provided this building and the tooling that will be set inside it in order to allow us to manufacture four of the six coils. These coils have to be manufactured here because their size and weight doesn't allow us to manufacture them elsewhere. The coils uh, will be produced in this facility um, using a range of tooling that is going to be delivered over the next six to nine months. My name is Jamathista Fakin. I work as a technical officer in Fusion for Energy with the PF coils. The first equipment for the manufacturing of PF coil is arrived on site and is being assembled. It is the winding tooling produced by the Sea Alp Engineering Consortium and which will be used to bend an average of 12 kilometers of cable in conduits per coil. It will be done with a millimetric accuracy to get a conductor in an O-shaped trajectory to form one module, which is known as a double pancake. It will take approximately three years to get the conductor shaped like that and to complete the fabrication of the PFO coils. My name is Pier Giorgio Prilli. I work in Fusion for Energy as a technical officer in the PF coils. All the manufacturing steps of the PF coils will be carried out here, like the DPs, winding, impregnation, stacking, and the final coil test. The building will be an exceptionally large, clean facility, able to accommodate up to 80 people working in different uh, workshop, facility areas, and offices. The PF building is equipped with two reins, uh, able to lift 25 and 40 tons. And later on, it will be installed a gantry crane able to lift the impressive load of 400 tons. To get the facility ready and operation, FRE has signed a contract with Dalca Veolia Consortium in order to furnish the facility to operate and maintain the infrastructures, to train the personnel in the use of infrastructures and the cranes, and to manage the waste during the PF coil manufacturing. The tooling and this manufacturing facility forms a new chapter in the history of the manufacture of the PF coils. 